this document from ACM, we have used the DOI to automatically assign the basic metadata. But if I now just control click on the page and itself, and without selecting any text, and I choose the names, it will now extract all the names of the document. This could be any AI prompt, and the user can define it themselves. I find it interesting to get the names out. It's an AI way of getting a bit of entity extraction. So that runs off, takes a bit of time, and then the results appear here. It's a nice and clean list, so I just click Save Metadata here at the bottom, close this window, and now we can see there's an extra page here on the right with all that metadata, including, let me just zoom in here, the prompt. And the AI engine that was used and the operation was done. It doesn't know that it was me who did it because we haven't built that into um, Reader yet. It doesn't know who's doing operations. But the point of this is this metadata is now usable in the same way that highlighted text in the document is usable meaning that we can search in the library for it. So I'm hoping that in XR views, we'll be able to use this data to look inside thousands of documents that we have done this operation with. Of course, I know that it manually, but it should be automatable at some point. So we have access to a lot of what's in the documents without the weight of having to bring the documents in full into the environment. Anyway, thank you very much for having a look. I'm super excited by this. It's just crazy. It's such a good start to 2024 with the Sloan grant, where hopefully we're going to have a WebSocket that can easily, quickly, without any fuss for the end user, get their metadata into the headset so they can start doing these operations.